You know, it works very much like a pregnancy test. You swab your gums, which of course isn't how a pregnancy test works, but in this case, you swab your gums and then you get the answer. Uh, one line if it's one way and two lines if it's gone the other way. And this is really the exact same test that doctors have used for years. One line is negative, two lines is positive. And actually, this is really important because one in five people who are HIV positive don't know it and this store mm. uh, could be in this, this this test rather won't be in the stores immediately but certainly uh, hopefully after you know more than a few months I think it begs the question there are plenty of false positives and false negatives in the pregnancy tests and that can be mm. life ending in the HIV tests how good are these Right here, the big concern is about false negatives because you can get false negatives. So you're at home, you see negative, you see terrific, and what you don't realize is that perhaps it's wrong. Now, when you get the results, you know you're you're talking to a professional and they can explain that to you. So that's certainly one concern with this test. The other concern is, let's say it's positive, you're alone and you've just found out that you can you have what can be you know a really devastating disease and there's no one to talk you through it. That's another concern. Well, to say the very least, yeah. What about the cost of this thing? Is it the same? I mean, the pregnancy tests are upwards of a few bucks, I think. But um, what about this one? You know, it might not be quite as cheap as pregnancy tests, and we don't know the exact price yet. But certainly it will sort of be in the neighborhood of something that's affordable. It won't be crazy expensive. So we had the okay. When does it hit the shelves? Do we know? Uh, we don't know. They need a couple more months to work mm -hmm. out labels and all that kind of stuff. So it won't be immediate. You are so on it. You get stuff.